Uh, hey, it's me. I just wanted to make this quick video to talk about my 2018 Anthem mashup. It's been delayed for several reasons and I think all of you should know about it. First of all, my life is getting busier, I'm growing older and my job lack of a job needs me to invest more and more time into real life stuff. I started making mashups as a student when I had a lot of free time but it's clearly not the case now. It may not seem like it, but making a year and mashup takes me around 100 hours and the more it goes, the less time I have to invest into this. Second point, the state of YouTube right now makes it less and less enjoyable for us creators to make mashups. On one hand, there's the YouTube copyright system that regularly take down mashups. Super talented people had their mashups or even their channels taken down for stupid copyright reasons, while some of their videos had millions of views. On the other hand, mashups are becoming more and more popular, everybody is making them for whatever reasons, the market is saturated and I don't feel like it's worth it for me to invest time and mental health into something that other people will probably do way better than me. Let's not also forget about all the people who relentlessly steal videos, call it their own, removing watermarks and getting all the credit for it. Third and last point, my music taste evolved. I don't enjoy pop music as much as I used to, I have a hard time following every new songs and artist that comes out every month and trust me, it's way harder to make a mashup when 80% of the songs you use are songs you don't like but feel like you have to put in for people to enjoy. Because yes, despite having a hundred songs in every each of my mashups, I get each year's comment from people asking me for that one song they like that didn't make it through. Fuck those people by the way. So, to summarize, I don't feel like spending hundreds of hours every year on something I don't enjoy anymore only for the final product to be taken down, stolen or criticized over the absence of a dozen songs. So, what is up with the 2018 mashup? I started making it. I will finish it. Probably. I don't know when it's gonna drop but I'd say around January 2019. Will it be good? I have no idea. How many songs? I have no idea. Will I continue making one every year? I don't think so. I will continue posting content on this channel, but expect more personal things from now on. I have several other musical projects. First, this one, Squiller, which is initially meant to be about original songs and remixes. But as you can see, I haven't uploaded a significant project in a big while because of the year in my shit. And also depression. depression. Some of you may already know it, but I also make a mixtape every summer with friends. Cause if you wanna try, oh my, that's just my favorite dime. You go pass if you're not blind, it makes your body cry. We just make cool songs together and invite artists to join us. I also have a sort of ironic techno French band called Le Son Vert. We released an album this year and we have a lot of fun doing it. What I want to say with this video is, don't expect huge mashups at the end of every year anymore. I will keep making some, but not as regularly, probably not as huge, I don't know yet. I just want to let go of that pressure, I have to always do better and bigger every year for the sake of competing with other YouTube channels. It's stupid, it's useless, and it's definitely not what I've started this channel for. Conclusion. The 2018 mashup is coming around 2019, but it's probably going to be the last Anthem mashup as you know it currently. I'm sorry if you expected something huge. Actually, I'm not sorry. As most of my subscribers joined this channel only for those mashups, I'd understand if you guys are disappointed or even unsubscribing. This is also an opportunity for you guys to think about what the YouTube environment is becoming and how much pressure it puts on every creator. I'll see you guys in 2019. Happy end of the year.